Today, we're exploring the question, is stealth broken in seven days to die alpha 20? Now we've got a lot of info to cover and no time to waste, so let's get to it. One of the most popular character builds in seven days to die is the stealth build. However, many players have commented that stealth does not seem to be nearly as effective in alpha 20 as it was in previous alphas. I myself first noticed this during streamer weekend. Even though my character's stealth perks were fairly high, the zombies seemed to wake up much more often than they used to. This issue became even more apparent during one of my live streams. Even with a completely maxed out stealth character, I could not keep the zombies from waking up while clearing this little rural church. So I decided to look into it and research why. And ladies and gentlemen, I found something very very interesting. But before I reveal what I found, I first have to explain sleeper volumes. This is the mechanic that Seven Days to Die uses to spawn zombies into POIs. To demonstrate this, I've created a simple little test POI in the prefab editor. I went ahead and placed down some sleeper zombies, and next we have to create the sleeper volumes that will govern the zombies' behaviors. This little box here is the sleeper volume. It governs the behaviors of all of the zombies inside this little box. So I went ahead and split up my sleeper zombies into two separate groups, and we're gonna go ahead and take a look at the sleeper volume itself. Now the thing that we wanna focus on the most is the trigger settings, of which there are three. The first setting is the passive setting. This setting pretty much makes it so the zombies stay asleep until they're attacked. As you see here, I can walk throughout all of these sleeper zombies, they do not wake up, I can literally get on top of them and jump up and down and they do not wake up. The only way that these zombies will wake up is if you interact with them like punching them in the face. Once you do that, the sleeper zombie will wake up and start attacking you. The second trigger setting is active. And this is the setting that is used most often. If the sleeper volume is set to active, the zombies will wake up if you make too much noise. Once they sense that the player is there, they will wake up and attack. So as you see here, I'm kind of skirting on the outside, but once I make a little bit too much noise, oh no, the zombies know I'm there, they wake up and they start attacking. Me. Again, this is the most common trigger setting used in this game, and the active setting is what allows stealth to be possible, because you can lower your noise level, meaning the zombies will not detect you and stay asleep. This gives you the ability to hit those sneak attacks and get that awesome sneak attack damage multiplier. The third trigger setting is the attack trigger setting. If the sleeper volume is set to attack, the zombie jerks will wake up the moment you enter. So once again, we take a look at the test POI and you see the outline of the sleeper volume. The moment your character crosses that threshold and enters that box, every single zombie in that sleeper volume will wake up and attack the player. So now that we know how sleeper volumes work, let's take a closer look at that rural church POI that I discussed earlier. Even with a maxed out character, every single time I'd enter a room, the zombies would automatically wake up and attack me. Did not matter what I did, they always woke up and attacked me. So I decided to load up this church POI in the prefab editor, and I was absolutely shocked by what I found. Every single sleeper volume was set to attack. That means that no matter your stealth skills, the zombies will always wake up. In previous alphas, I called these trigger rooms, meaning the moment that you walked into the room, all the zombies automatically knew you were there, they would wake up and attack you. And I think that description is still valid. But what this shows is that every single sleeper volume in this POI is a trigger room. This totally negates stealth. It makes it pointless. It makes it meaningless. Why spend all of your points going into stealth if every single sleeper volume is set to attack? It makes no sense. At first, I thought maybe it was an isolated incident. Perhaps it was only this one POI that had this issue. So I decided to load up several of the new POIs that were introduced in Alpha 20 into the prefab editor and take a look. And you guessed it, ladies and gentlemen, I found at least one, but usually multiple 
multiple, if not all of the sleeper volumes were set to attack in every single new POI that I pulled up in the prefab editor. Once again, by setting the sleeper volumes to attack, you make stealth pointless. And it seems like every single new POI that was introduced in Alpha 20 has at least one of these trigger rooms. However, most of them have several. Now, while there may be other factors at play, by setting the sleeper volumes to attack, you totally negate stealth. Which begs the question, was this a simple oversight or was this intentional? One of the main selling points of Alpha 20 was the addition of all of these new POIs. So in their rush to develop these new POIs, did they simply overlook the fact that all of the sleeper volumes or at least a good majority of the sleeper volumes were set to attack? Or did they intentionally set the sleeper volumes to attack in order to completely nerf the stealth build. Personally, I am hoping that this was an oversight and the devs will take a look at the new POI soon and adjust the sleeper volumes accordingly. But I'd like to hear what you all think. Do you believe that this was a simple oversight or do you think that this was intentional? Let me know in the comments below. And if you'd like to check out some of my other 7 Days to Die Alpha 20 videos, I've created a very special playlist that you can access by clicking the box in the top right corner of the screen. But for now, this is Savin saying thank you, ladies and gentlemen, and we'll catch you in the next one.